Uh, hi, I'm Phil Rowan, Executive Director and CEO of the Battleship New Jersey Museum and Memorial. And I'm uh, here in the office's wardroom and uh, thinking back about the uh, 20 years ago when we brought the uh, ship up the Delaware uh, River, uh, Doctor at the Philadelphia Navy Shipyard. And, uh, I've been involved with the Battleship for about 22 years. Uh, original incorporator of the Port Alliance, and uh, we've seen a lot of changes on the ship, and I'm just amazed uh, how fast 20 years goes by. I really enjoyed the time uh, being on the ship and being involved in preserving the world's greatest battleship. The ship was coming up the river. The governor had a ferry reserved, and uh, veterans of the ship were on the ferry with her, and we followed the ship up. After that, I went, got off, and uh, we drove up to the Philly shipyard, and I got into the shipyard and watched them dock the ship in the uh, Philly shipyard. Yes, the day the battleship returned to Delaware, as having a privilege of helping write the application to the Navy, it was an incredible experience seeing the ship, which I now only saw for the first time when it came up to arrive back home to the Delaware River. It was such an honor and privilege to be part of it, and now as it serves as a grand memorial museum. Well, I worked on it back in the 1960s. Um, I would just gotten out of the Navy, uh, applied for a job at the Philadelphia Navy Yard. I ended up, uh, they asked me what I do in the Navy. I said I was an engineman. They said, good, we'll put you in ordnance. And I worked on the guns, the big guns, five inch guns. And I removed the 40 millimeters back in the uh, in 1967, uh, November, early December. So other than that, you know, I've been here for 16 years working on the ship as a volunteer um, and uh, enjoyed every day of it. I watched the battleship come up the river with my wife Janet, my young son Matthew, and my co-workers from the Courier Post newspaper where I worked at the time. We were all watching from a place called Soupy Island in West Deptford, which was directly across the river from the, where the battleship would be docked at the Navy Yard. When the ship got directly in front of us, the sun was shining. It was very, very beautiful. My son, I have a photo of him and I watching the ship at the edge of the river. And today that little toddler from the photo is a 21 year old, six foot, two inch tall college student. And when I look at that photo, the passage of time really hits home to me. 